Cell Monitor is the software that connects each wireless Freepoint remote to a Shiftworks server. It needs to be installed on a computer containing Windows 7 or newer. The computer needs to be inside the plant within 300 feet of all remotes connected to a USB master device or data aggregator, as mentioned in the previous video. Cell Monitor is what specifically aggregates the data and can be used to set up machines and create your account for Shiftworks. Before installing the software, be sure that all Freepoint wireless remotes are fully installed in each machine. Ensure that the USB device is connected to the computer and has a line of sight to each wireless remote. Installing Cell Monitor requires the application installer, which will be supplied by Freepoint. Administrator permissions on the computer are also required. If you are not the administrator, you will need to talk with your IT department. Double click the installer to run it and then click yes on the warning prompt if it appears. Click Next to acknowledge the recommendations and the summary of Cell Monitor, and agree to the terms of use to continue the installation. Choose a different destination folder if you'd like to install the software to another file location. For this video, I will install it to the default location. This panel gives you the option to choose where the shortcut for the software will be in the Start menu. I will put the shortcut in the default location again. Cell Monitor requires two components to operate, so ensure that both boxes are selected for normal operation, then select Install. On this window, click the button labeled Extract. Now you must install the drivers that accompany the software. Click Next and accept the terms and conditions. Click Next, Finish, Next again, and then finally click Finish on the last panel. Now that Cell Monitor is installed, you may start creating your profile by opening the shortcut created on your desktop if you allowed the installer to create one. If you do not have a shortcut on your desktop, try searching Cell Monitor in your Start menu. Click yes on the prompt to allow changes to your computer if the prompt appears, and click on begin. Now you will create your profile by filling out all input fields. For this demonstration, I will create a generic account. When you're ready, continue to the next window. This window gives you the option to select the Freepoint master device that's connected to the computer. If you do not see anything, make sure that the USB device is properly plugged into the computer. Click on the USB master and select Test Connection. This ensures that you have the correct device connected to Cell Monitor. If you get this error message, click OK, and then right click on the Freepoint master and select Force Selected Device. Next you will see a list of connected remotes. Name them any way you'll understand. For my example, I will name the remote CNC Machine. This box is a 4i, so it only has 4 input fields. An 8i, 12i, or 16i would have more input options. My example machine will have a spindle, power, and axis as inputs. These inputs were previously wired during hardware installation with sensors clipped to the spindle and axis power leads in the machine. If you do not use all the input fields in this panel, just type a label to signify that the field is not an active input. I will type spare. Clicking register remote will save all the changes at this stage, but it will not push any data to the Shiftworks server. Once all remotes are registered, click Next and Finish. This window is Cell Monitor. It is only used for configuring and updating your remote information as well as troubleshooting. This window needs to be closed for your remotes to continue displaying their data on Shiftworks because the software continues to run even when the window is closed. The left side of the screen displays a complete list of wireless remotes. Remotes with green dots beside them indicate that the page has been registered with this computer's installation of Cell Monitor but the remotes with a black dot are not. The largest panel in the center of the screen displays all the information about the remote selected on the left panel. This information includes what state each input is and will record the time or counts of the inputs. From this panel you can edit each remote's components, register them, or unregister them. The bottom panel updates the machine state in real time. In this panel you may filter how the list updates. You can also clear the table or stop displaying the output by selecting the options on the top right corner of the panel. When you are ready to let the data update on Shiftworks, go to the File menu and then select Save. This pushes the configuration to Shiftworks. To get the services to start, just close Cell Monitor. A prompt will come up saying that the services are starting automatically. Once the services have started, the data will be synced in the background. It will continue to run if the computer is powered on, regardless of whether a user is logged in or not. If you open the cell monitor window, data will stop being pushed because it assumes that you're making more configuration changes. To learn more, please contact us at info at getfreepoint.com.